Hi guys, today we have a problem about Packard Bell laptop uh, that that shows a message about default device missing or boot failed. It is a common problem, so don't worry, it's easy to repair. You don't need really to worry, just let me show you, okay? So when you click OK, it's gonna uh, uh, show a boot manager. Mm, but first we have to restart the computer and turn it on again let's turn it on so it will be start again but we must click F2 to get into the BIOS let's try once again and click ok we got here and we should click and sorry we should click arrow on the right and go to the main there is security and next is boot and in this in this section you got boot mode UFE click enter and this will show you uh, two options which are UFE and legacy you should choose legacy then click enter again now it will show you that uh, you must reboot it and save so enter and now as you see in the right down corner that you have to click F10 to save your changes so please click F10 key and click yes enter this will reboot and now it should start properly okay so it's everything for this video now it should have properly working notebook but to summarize first we had to restart our computer and go to the BIOS settings by clicking one of the keys special keys and then we would go to the options where you had to choose UEFI or legacy you should click legacy options then save exit and restart and that is it it should work now so I hope it worked for you if not please tell me in the comments what is it working and I will try to help you but for now it's everything so thank you very much and hope you have a great day bye bye